guys, it's Allie here. Happy New Year. I hope you are all having a great 2021 so far. And for those of you who are new, hi, welcome. So, how many of you created so many goals for the new year, so many resolutions that you had high hopes for, and now three weeks into January and you've completely given up or forgotten about them or a combination of both? <laughs> I know it's easier said than done to keep up with your resolutions, so today I'm going to be sharing some tips with you guys of how to keep yourself motivated to do your resolutions, and yeah, so without further ado, let's get into the video. So my first tip, which is my favorite tip, is to create a dream board or vision board for your resolutions. It's pretty much just a board of pictures that describe each of your goals um, and you can include like quotes but it's really just a way to help you visualize the outcomes of your resolutions and keep you motivated to achieve that point to complete your resolutions and get to the point that those pictures describe. Um, I have done this the last two years on the board. I actually have the board hanging right above me on my wall. But this year, because I'm not going to be at home, I'm going to be at college, I decided to make um, my dream board be my phone wallpaper, and I did this on Canva. So any digital like collage kind of website, you can make um, a phone collage, make your dream board be your background, and that way you can see it every day and be reminded of your goals. And yeah, if you're interested in seeing how I made my actual like physical dream board from last year i will link that video at the end of this video for you guys to see my 2020 um, dream board another tip that i also like to do is create a word of the year um, it's pretty much just summarizes all of your resolutions or is a word that describes how you want to live your year and just one word is so much easier to remember than like a whole list of revolutions resolutions so it just kind of summarizes it all up i also created um a phone wallpaper so i have it as my lock screen i can see my word of the year every day my word this year is live because i feel like last year with the pandemic like we missed out on so many opportunities and i just want to live life to the fullest this year and live every moment like it could possibly be my last because you never know so yeah just to give you an idea of kind of what the word of the year is and I definitely recommend it because it is so helpful and so powerful tip number three is to make a habit tracker or a resolutions tracker you can do this in a bullet journal or just a regular journal or a planner or even on like a piece of computer paper just a way to help you keep track of completing your resolutions everybody likes to see of things getting crossed off the list and things getting done so this is a way to really hold you accountable for uh, completing your resolutions and helping you keep up with um, carrying them out so it's a great way to do that I have mine up on my whiteboard on my wall right up here um, and I just put a dot below like every day that I remember to work out or to eat three meals a day eating healthy or every time that I remember to stay off my phone after 9 p.m. some of my resolutions just to give you guys examples but um it's just a great way to hold you accountable for them. Hey guys, sorry to interrupt the video, but while I was editing here, I had thought of one more tip that I wanted to add before I give you guys the last one. Um, and that is to use the reminders app on your phone to create um, a specific folder just for your resolutions. And you can set up specific days and times that you want to be reminded and you can even like change the importance level and you can like rank them things that are more important to get done during the day and I love to use this and I organize I have so many different um, folders of reminders but it is so helpful I cannot live without the reminders app so I definitely recommend using that for your resolutions as well okay now back to the regular video and the last tip to keep up with your resolutions is to just 
share your resolutions with friends and family, talk about them with each other. That way you can hold each other accountable and motivate each other to keep going and carry them out. You can check in every once in a while like, hey, how's your exercising resolution going? Or how are you doing with being more outgoing this year? And you know, I know it's hard sometimes to talk about resolutions with other people because you might be embarrassed about them or they're really personal. And of course you don't have to share those, but it's just really nice to be in this together with other people, especially this year when, um, when you can't really be with people face to face. So those are my tips for how to keep going with your New Year's resolutions, how to be motivated to complete them, to remember them, be reminded of them. I hope that these tips really help you and I hope you guys try some of these out yourself. If you do, please comment down below because I always love to hear from you guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, please like this video and please feel free to subscribe to one of my resolutions this year is to try to upload more. And I'm pretty sure I said that last year too, but I'm really going to try this year. So yeah, I hope you stick around to see that. I hope you have a very blessed 2021 and I hope all of your dreams and goals come true. Thank you so much again and I will see you in my next video. Bye!